look up at the night sky, a vast canvas of twinkling lights and cosmic wonders. For millennia we've gazed upwards filled with curiosity and wonder, asking ourselves what mysteries lie beyond our reach. We built telescopes, each one revealing more, galaxies, stars, and the vastness of space. These instruments became our eyes, extending our vision into the cosmos. But Earth's atmosphere blurred our view, like reading a book underwater, distorting the clarity of the universe's story. The oldest light, stretched by the universe's expansion, slipped beyond what our eyes and most telescopes could see, hidden in the infrared spectrum. To truly understand our origins, we needed a new kind of eye, one that could see the invisible, capturing the whispers of the universe's infancy. Engineers and scientists dreamed up a telescope so large it had to fold to fit in a rocket, with a mirror so precise it could spot a bumblebee's heat on the moon, a feat of engineering marvel. Its mission, to capture the faint ancient light from the first stars and galaxies after the Big Bang, offering us a glimpse into the universe's earliest moments. This wasn't just another telescope, it was a time machine, allowing us to peer back billions of years into the past, and so, we built it, the James Webb Space Telescope, a testament to human ingenuity and ambition. A golden honeycomb, a million miles from Earth, peering deeper than ever before, unraveling the secrets of the cosmos. Through Webb, we're seeing a universe stranger and more beautiful than we imagined, filled with vibrant nebulae and distant galaxies. But the data it sends back is overwhelming, far too much for any human to process alone, a deluge of cosmic information. To unlock its secrets we needed a new kind of partner, one that could help us decipher the universe's complex language. Enter the age of intelligent machines where AI becomes our ally in exploring the cosmos, transforming data into understanding. The James Webb Space Telescope is a marvel of modern engineering, a giant golden mirror stretching an incredible 21 feet across, floating silently in the vastness of space. Its mirror is made up of 18 perfectly crafted hexagonal segments, each one meticulously aligned to work together as a single, flawless surface. Coated in a thin layer of gold, these segments reflect infrared light with remarkable efficiency, allowing Webb to peer deeper into the universe than any telescope before it and to witness the universe's earliest moments, moments that have been hidden from us until now. To achieve this, Webb must remain colder than even the emptiest regions of deep space, protected by a five-layer sunshield that's as large as a tennis court and as thin as a human hair. On one side of the sunshield, temperatures soar, as hot as a summer's day on Earth. On the other, they plunge to levels colder than Pluto, creating a dramatic contrast that keeps the telescope's instruments perfectly chilled. From its distant perch, nearly a million miles away at the L2 Lagrange point, Webb gazes into the cosmos, free from the blurring effects of Earth's atmosphere and the interference of our planet's heat. It collects ancient photons, light that has traveled for billions of years, revealing the birth of stars and the formation of the very first galaxies. Webb also studies the atmospheres of distant exoplanets, searching for the chemical fingerprints of life and unraveling the mysteries of worlds far beyond our solar system. It captures the dramatic collisions of galaxies, helping us understand how cosmic structures evolve and change over time. But with every breathtaking image, Webb sends back a torrent of data, so much information that no single scientist or even a team could hope to analyze it all alone. Each observation is a complex puzzle, filled with subtle patterns, hidden signals, and clues about the universe's deepest secrets, waiting to be discovered. We have built the perfect eye to explore the cosmos, but now we need a new kind of brain, one that can sift through mountains of data and uncover the stories hidden within. That's where quantum AI comes in, promising to revolutionize our understanding of the universe by making sense of what Webb sees. Classical computers use bits, ones and zeros to process information. These bits are like tiny switches, flipping on or off, forming the foundation of all modern computing. Every app, website, and digital tool you use relies on this simple yet powerful system of binary code. They're powerful but for some problems they're slow, like solving a maze one turn at a time. Imagine having to try every possible path one after another until you find the exit. For complex challenges this can take an enormous amount of time and energy. Quantum computers use qubits which can be zero, one, or both at once, exploring many solutions simultaneously. This unique property called superposition allows quantum computers to process information in ways that classical computers simply can't. It's like walking every path in a maze at the same time, instantly checking all possible routes. 
This means quantum computers can tackle problems that would take classical computers years or even centuries to solve. Combine this with artificial intelligence and you get quantum AI, a system that can see patterns in massive, complex data sets that classical computers and humans can't. Quantum AI can sift through oceans of data, making connections and predictions at speeds that were once unimaginable. Quantum AI doesn't just follow instructions, it explores possibilities, learning and adapting as it goes. It can discover new solutions, optimize processes, and even generate creative ideas, all by leveraging the strange rules of quantum physics. These machines are new, delicate, and still evolving, but their potential is enormous. Scientists are racing to make them more stable and accessible, knowing that each breakthrough could change the world. For problems like designing medicines or decoding cosmic signals, they promise a revolution. Quantum AI could help us cure diseases faster, understand the universe more deeply, and solve mysteries that have puzzled humanity for generations. Recently, scientists at the SETI Institute decided to unleash quantum AI on the data from our most powerful new eye, a telescope capable of capturing vast amounts of information from the cosmos. They wanted to see if this new brain could find what humans might miss, searching for patterns and signals hidden deep within the noise of space. The goal, to search for the unknown in the light from distant stars. The experiment was bold, pushing the boundaries of both technology and imagination. The results would be historic, marking a new era in our quest to understand the universe and our place within it. How do you teach a quantum computer to analyze space telescope data? Scientists designed a quantum algorithm to hunt for anomalies, patterns that defy our understanding of physics and chemistry. They trained it on thousands of known planetary atmospheres, teaching it what normal looks like. Then, they fed it new data from Kepler-186f, an exoplanet in the habitable zone, long suspected to be Earth-like. Webb had captured the starlight passing through Kepler-186f's atmosphere, creating a barcode of its chemical makeup. The quantum AI compared this barcode to all it had learned, searching for anything out of place. Unlike classical computers, it explored millions of possibilities at once. The scientists waited, hoping for a hint of something new. What they got was more than a hint. The quantum AI flagged a pattern no human or classical computer had ever noticed. It was a cosmic anomaly, a signal that demanded attention. The gamble had paid off. The universe had whispered back. The quantum AI's analysis was lightning fast. It found a section of kepler 186 f spectrum that was wildly out of place, a 99.9% .9 probability of being unnatural. Human analysts had missed it. The signal was buried in noise, but the quantum AI isolated a unique blend of molecules, water vapor, carbon dioxide, and crucially, methane in a ratio with oxygen that shouldn't exist naturally. On Earth, such an imbalance is a hallmark of life. Imagine finding the smell of fresh bread in a sealed room. You know something is baking. The chemical signature on Kepler-186F was the cosmic equivalent. Scientists tried to explain it with volcanoes or minerals, but nothing fit. Every natural explanation failed, the only logical conclusion, a biosphere. The data pointed to life, the universe had just revealed a secret. This wasn't proof of aliens but something deeper, the unmistakable fingerprint of life. The quantum AI had decoded a biosignature oxygen, methane, and isoprene all in stable abundance. On Earth, isoprene is produced by plants, it has no significant non-biological source. Finding it alongside oxygen and methane was like finding a fossil in the sky. Webb's data, filtered through quantum AI, painted a picture of a living world. This was no guesswork. It was a rigorous, data-driven conclusion. Life, it seemed, was not unique to Earth. Kepler-186f orbits a dim red dwarf. Its plants might be black, its sky a dusky orange. But under that alien sun, the evidence suggested an ecosystem was breathing. For the first time, we moved from asking, are we alone, to who are our neighbors? The implications were staggering. Life is not a miracle, it's a cosmic pattern. The universe is alive in more ways than we ever dreamed, and we had proof. This discovery changes everything. If life can arise on Kepler-186f, it can arise anywhere conditions are right. There are billions of habitable planets in our galaxy alone. The cosmos is not empty, it's a garden, blooming with possibilities. The search for life is no longer a shot in the dark, we have a map and a method. Quantum AI and Webb have opened a new field comparative astrobiology. We must now rethink our place in the universe. We are not alone, but part of a vast, living cosmos. This knowledge should inspire humility and responsibility. Our planet is precious, but not unique. 
The story of life is a cosmic story, and we are just beginning to read its first pages. Why does this matter to us here and now? Because exploration is in our DNA. The partnership between web and quantum AI marks a new era, one where human curiosity and machine intelligence work together. These tools will not only find life, but help us solve problems here on Earth, medicine, energy, climate. The quest to understand the universe is also a quest to understand ourselves. This is a moment to be inspired. For every young person looking up at the sky, this is a call to action. Be part of the journey, scientist, engineer, artist, dreamer. The universe is full of secrets and we are just getting started. The message from Kepler 186F is one of hope. Life endures, even in the vast dark. Our journey to the stars has just begun, and the next chapter belongs to all of us.